kind of is Wayne Goodso. As the Book of Mormon, which is the keystone of Mormonism, says at the beginning of the book that it is to be interpreted according to the learning of the Jews. It means that the Church of Jesus Christ of Latter-day Saints is the great and abominable church spoken of by the Book of Mormon and by Joseph Smith. Therefore, everything that they do, everything that's in the news, everything they say at conference, is a lie and is a cover-up for criminal activity. Today's news story from the Church News is yet another example. Today, it was reported that Nelson had met with uh, King Gamansi, if I'm pronouncing that correctly, of Ghana. The King. And if you've not been paying attention to the news, Ghana went belly up. They went bust. Last year it was reported in uh, December. They had uh, signed a three billion dollar bailout deal and it is to take effect right about now apparently. Uh, finding sources uh, from Reuters February 14th, 2023, Ghana's finance ministry on Tuesday said that around 85% of eligible bondholders had registered for its domestic debt exchange program. Uh, January 2nd, 2023, once described as Africa's shining star at, by the World Bank, Ghana had the world's fastest growing economy in 2019 after it doubled its economic and now they went bust. He's hurting for money. And now Nelson is stepping in to do a business deal, taking advantage of Ghana. Let's see if they've... I'm most likely sure they've got a yeah, LDS Ghana Church of Jesus Christ of Latter-day Saints in Ghana. They still haven't got anybody remember the scandal with my brother recently? The church is refusing to post <laughs> the membership stats. Because my brother failed. <laughs> Hilarious. Uh, the church was introduced to Ghana, West Africa in 1962, officially recognized in 1978. Hmm. Following the announcement on the revelation of the priesthood. So there's more behind this than I realized. I'm the one who found out that the Edmunds Tucker Act was repealed that same year. The church is up to no good here. They're bringing back polygamy, but I see that they're, they had other dealings with Ghana to solidify the distraction. And I have another video planned because of a comment that I received from somebody who's prophesying of how the millennium is going to be. It was quite amusing. <laughs> but uh, nonetheless, yeah, there's the uh, Accra Ghana Temple. That's the capital, where the king has his capital. In. And uh, as of 2021, <laughs> There's 96,508 members, 29 stakes, 9 districts, 195 wards, 146 branches, 4 missions, uh, an operating temple, another one was announced, I don't remember which conference, but uh, yeah.
the church has a presence in Ghana. And notice that the church, being recognized since 1978, is the true church of Jesus. Jesus heals. Come join the church and you'll prosper. They economically collapsed. Everything the church touches is destroyed. This is a fact. I did this video when Ballard did his little thing on the church news about how he went to an African country with money to help and then it rained and so they didn't help. And, the, and that country is now suffering greater than when the church came to give them assistance, which the millions of dollars that they went in with should have solved all their problems for decades. And instead it got worse. The church does not give charity. This is a fact. They do business deals disguised as charity. And it hurts the people they do the deals with. This is the reality. This is how evil this church is. After all, they're the great and abominable church. Because you're supposed to see them, know them by their fruits. This is the fruits of the church being in Ghana. The economy collapsed. Oh, maybe they didn't pay their tithing. <laughs> we already know Nelson's been robbing God. And so, yeah, this is the breaking news story for today. Nelson involved in uh, crimes against Ghana. Do not let him get that award on Thursday. The Gandhi King Mandela Award for Peace. He does not deserve it. It will be a humiliating embarrassment and a disgrace to blacks all over the world. Don't let him get that award. How can I make that more serious for you?